It's a busy morning in the Fox household. Mum Megan is off to work and her 12-year-old son Hayden is getting ready for school. Do you want a smoothie this morning? While the morning routine is the same, school in 2022 is different. Uncomfortable and stuff because of like the masks. Teachers and older students are masked up. There are no social events like swimming or athletic carnivals and parents aren't allowed past the school gates. It's such a shock to not be able to even go like, you know, who were your teachers and, you know, who are they? Show me them in the playground or, you know, or just even go into the office. While parents are happy to see an end to virtual learning, the ongoing restrictions at school mean students and parents are feeling socially disconnected. Parents are really missing those everyday interactions between other parents um, or with teachers in their school community. With a further easing of COVID restrictions in the ACT tomorrow night, parents say the current school rules don't make sense. I went out to a concert or to a show that I hadn't, you haven't been to a show for years. I go to that and I could have gone out dancing at the nightclub on my way home and, you know, vertically drunk or whatever I wanted to do. Not that I did any of that stuff. Um, but and then on Monday morning, I can't even walk in the school gate with a mask on. Across the border in New South Wales, school life is returning to normal from next week. Here in Canberra, parents aren't calling for an end to all school restrictions, but they want gentle steps to help reconnect school communities. We'd like to see uh, parents being allowed on site, at the very least outdoors, because teachers are a really important um, part of our kids' lives. The Health Minister says while the rules will be refined, some will remain in place. Those safeguards around things like cohorting, minimising the mixing of students um, outside of the classroom uh, and particularly where that's in indoor spaces, I'm sure that those things will continue. The COVID Balancing Act with schools at the centre. Lisa Glenday, ABC News, Canberra.